18 objects. Ooh. <coughs> Very nice. Let's see what we scan though. Whoops, wrong button. At least in deep space, not close to a star. Let's see what we scanned. So I got this star, got that star, class L, class M, argon atmosphere, high middle content world, nitrogen atmosphere, high middle content world with its rocky moon, icy body with nitrogen, and then I never scanned these, didn't scan that one, nope, methane rich, still an icy body though. I never touched this, but I did neon rich. Ice metal. Let's get out of here. Thirty one. Oh, yeah. Couple of those. Should be able to do something with this for sure. Check this out. Okay, so we've got a class one gas giant, no biggie. An ice body. Gas giant with ammonia based ice or ammonia based algae. Uh, another gas giant. Then we've got a high middle content world, carbon dioxide rich atmosphere. Silicate vapor atmosphere type. Nice. Twenty one objects. Get some fuel here. Hmm. Well, that's going to be cool to look at. That's got to be nothing but ice. Fuel scooping complete. Wait, wait, what's this moon? Could be something. What about this one? Anything? Could, I don't think so, but could be. Besides some of the moons, icy body with helium atmosphere. Oh. There's a party. Gas one. Class one. Class one with icy rings. Uh, class four, our primary hydrogen helium atmosphere. Okay, hydrogen helium. Rocky ring. Metal rich, eh, at least there's something there. I scan these, uh. Okay, armor and what? Iron magma, atmosphere type water, 100% water. I still don't no, get water atmosphere, but wait, whatever. Did I scan this thing? No. So? There's another system. Uh, two skill points. So many. 
Oh, we got a nice system here. The outer ones look like gas giants, but it looks like we can do something with the inside here. Okay, that's everything in this system. Let's see what we got here. Argon atmosphere, icy body, argon atmosphere. High metal content world, no atmosphere. Yeah. With ammonia. Small tiny moon. Holy shit. That's kind of small too. Another high metal content. Another one, what's this? Rocky body. Nice. Eleven, very nice. Ah, first three planets look like there's something there. Fuel scooping complete. High metal, nitrogen atmosphere. <laughs> Nitrogen. Well, let's get out of here. Crankshift drive charging. Let's take a look, look at where we are on this whole. <clears throat> so there's Bernard's loop. That's where we're going there. So when we come home, same for Bernard's loop. And then we'll go right in. We're 4.5 thousand, 4, 4,500 light years away from occupied space. Couple of big ones, couple of little ones. Very good. Yep, ice ball, ice ball. Ice body, methane rich, water based light form, gas giant, high metal content world, carbon dioxide rich. High metal content world, carbon dioxide rich. It's because it's on fire. Nothing. It's a gas station. So we are looking for jellyfish. No, fish. Jellyfish sector. O I dash S V four dash one. Fuel scooping complete. Take me there. 788 light years to go. Let's plot the route. <clears throat> well, that's kind of squirrely. <laughs> Thirty-three objects. Let's get some fuel. Oh, nice. A red one, a purple one. 
So these spin around each other, and together they spin around this one. Alright. What? Hey, it's a freaking star! <laughs> Jeez! Let's take a look at this purple star. Got too close. I guess I'll crash here. Whatever. Look at that sucker spin. That looks cool. What I don't get is how is it leaving a dark spot over here? Dark spot, or frameshift drive charging. Four, three, two, one, engage. Warning, temperature critical. Warning, temperature critical. Man, that sucker spins fast. Look at it. So. I failed to realize that it was a star with metal-rich rings. Nice. Own your rich. Fast giant, high metal content world. Carbon dioxide rich. Metal rich body. Nice. Leave time. Drive charging. 30 jumps to go. Whoa. Twenty four. Oh, they're all lined up. Fuel scooping complete. This could This could be something. Depending how far these ones are, we'll see. Maybe we'll scan the whole thing. Gas giant. Gas giant. Gas giant. Gas giant. Good, good, good. Definitely gas giant. And uh, nitrogen. Nitrogen, oxygen, rock, metal. Okay. Okay. High metal content worlds. Frame ship drive charging. <sighs> 27 to go. Got a little close this time. Whoa. Fuel scooping complete. Definitely have a couple of worlds here. Argon rich atmosphere. 
radius. Okay, so they do orbit. Or maybe it's 27 days around this thing. Argon rich atmosphere. I don't know, I don't know how to read most of this stuff here. But. Hmm. Just that when I scanned these two and when I drove by them twice, there wasn't any orbit line around the star itself. But there were two orbit lines. So, I mean, they orbit around inside each other. It's kind of weird. Ooh, two stars. Nice. Scannable worlds. Very good. Could be something here. Fuel scooping complete. Okay, so we have methane rich, high metal content world. Carbon dioxide, which is the body as a candidate for terraforming. Yay! I knew there's something decent in here. Sulfur dioxide, just a high metal, another high metal, another high metal. K class and a G. Nice. Whoa. Very nice. And then there's something down here too. Fuel scooping complete. Okay. Let's get to it. Got it. Let's look at this. Let's take a look. <sighs> nice body with atmosphere. Nice body with atmosphere. Nothing. Carbon dioxide. Sulfuric dioxide. High metal content world. High metal content world. Sulfur dioxide. Uh huh, uh huh. And this one? And then two stars. Okay, let's take a look at where we are on the galaxy map. What's our next jump? That's where we are. Where we're going. Show me. No, won't show me. <clears throat> Going to be about five thousand light years when we get to the the nebula, or four thousand seven hundred from where we left our ships and you can see the nebula is starting to get bigger. It's awesome. Drive charging. 20 jumps to go. Oh, haven't seen this in a while. Three stars, got some good stuff here. Fuel scooping complete. Don't know about these. Might be something good there. Well, I'm gonna pass that a million miles an hour. Okay, so what do we got? We got an M star, an L dwarf, another M. High metal, high metal, no atmosphere, still no atmosphere, atmosphere, what's this? <clears throat> no atmosphere.
atmosphere, no atmosphere, volcanism. And then these, I think, are just ice bodies. Ooh. Like Scooping. Wow. Okay, looks like you got everything here. High metal, high metal. High metal, high metal. Ah, it's a nice body. Nitrogen, argon, helium. Gas giant. Rocky body, rocky body. Gas giant. Rocky body with ammonia. Another one. High metal content, high metal content. Thirty nine objects, holy shit. Whoa. So it looks like these bodies have an atmosphere to them. Fuel scooping complete. These ones don't. I wonder how far this last star is. Looks like we got everything scanned here. Glass giant, gas giant, gas giant, gas giant. Oh, missed that planet there. High middle content world with carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide. An M class, a T dwarf, and another M, M star. Whoa! That one took a minute and a half. Not bad! Ten objects. Let's get some juice. Kill your friends. Whoa! Nice line of uh, planets here to. Got a decent atmosphere over it. High metal content world with nitrogen. Nice. Water world with carbon dioxide. Uh, ter terrestrial water world with active water based chemistry and carbon water based life. Carbon dioxide. Cool. High metal content world with nitrogen. This body is candidate for terraforming. Another terraforming candidate. Carbon dioxide. What's this one? Sulfur dioxide. High metal content world. High metal content. So it's a terrestrial water world. Hopefully that's kind of what I'm looking for. Oh, that nebula is getting big. Frameshift drive charging. Let's leave. Nice first jellyfish sector star that we're entering. Forty-five objects. Whoa. Well, 
Time to get scanning, I guess. Both this star system have we completed. Nitrogen. Sulfur dioxide. Sulfur dioxide. K class star. M class star. Metal, metal. Atmosphere, carbon dioxide, rocky, 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 argon. Hmm. I don't think I scanned any of these. No, I didn't think so. High metal, high metal, metal rich body. 100% metal. Wow. There's two of them. That's probably going to be worth something. Three of them. It's pretty insane. Two jumps. Jump. Laser bolts in here. No need to scan. We are definitely in the jellyfish nebula. Inside of it, inside of it. And we aren't the first people to be here. Awesome, let's look around. So this planet should be, or this planet, this system should be in the nebula. Fuel skip disengaged. I mean, it looks like there's stuff out there, like dust and some sort of gas, but Hard to say. Like it looks really dark here. That's neat. We need to figure out how to go home. We're not in the darkest part of the nebula. Okay, so I was thinking about going to Bernard's Loop and checking that out, but I think I'm going to save that for another day. So I have selected, so this is where we are right now, and I selected this Colonel Cole 86 Sector DAN B3 blah blah blah. It is 976.47 light years. And that's the route. Decisive. Now, Decisive. I'm just gonna plan on Potato rushing potato home, potato. so as fast as I can go. Potato, potato. So let's get out of here. For our last turns. Frameship drive charging. Time to go home. <laughs>